provided this morning indicates that yielded 1.9 pounds of marijuana, um, which is obtained at a residence which Mr. Poole was not even at at the time they executed the search warrant, in addition to any weapon they found. They executed a search warrant at a separate residence, they alleged to be his, which I understand it was one joint or one marijuana cigarette found that location. So we denied the allegations. Uh, Mr. Poole is on a parole hold this time. That's why I reserve the right to make up an application until a later date. That parole hold is due to expire on the 2nd. So where do all these allegations of a $2 million operation, elaborate U.S. mail, uh, transportation? I, I'm not sure. We've been told there's been wiretaps. We haven't been provided with any of that documentation. We have not been provided with any search warrants at this point. But Mr. Poole was apprehended. He was in his vehicle. No narcotics, no marijuana, no gun found on his person. That was found at a residence, which my understanding was empty at the time they executed the search warrant. Sir, what about his daughter's backpack? Because that was a pretty egregious um, That's the allegation. first I heard of that this morning. Um, so I, I'm, again, I can't even address it. The first I heard of Here he is, a drug dealer, and he's running around in that car with the license plate that it says lifted, which I'm told was slang for getting high. Which is slang for getting high. But what is really infuriating is the fact that he has on this an official New York State license plate, keep kids drug free. Keep kids drug free. And this is a car that the number one reseller for pool was driving in New York.